Visco. Hi, welcome back to Visco channel. Today, I'll be showing on how to configure AMPR camera in high vision and VR for car plate searching. In order to add AMPR camera into high vision and VR, the first thing we need to ensure is to use a K series and above NVR, which can support the AMPR function. Another thing is that our camera must use must be used with the AMPR one. For so for our testing wise, we'll be using IDS seven seven three two and XI M four slash X, which will support the AMPR function, whereby we can tap from the data sheet. So we'll be showing the uh the the camera is being supported for all channels and also can look at the plate number, license plate color and the plate type and all. And another thing is on the camera we are that we are using is DS-TCG205-E. So this camera also support the AMPR. And then we will go to the next next step which is the testing side. Now so I will be doing this um demonstration on how to configure this AMPR into NVR, high vision NVR. So first of all we need to make sure the ANPR is uh, can be detected in SADP. So this is the AMPR model that we're using and also the NVR as well. So the NVR we're using is this. So both are online. So once both are online we can log into the their web page. So first of all, we log into the AMPR web page, and so we go to the configuration part, and then we go to this capture, capture parameter. So uh, you need to select your region first. On my side, I will select Asia Pacific for the region, and once the setting done, click save. And after that, we go to this application mode. We enable this license plate recognition system then we click on the second one and we you need to change the we need to select we need to adjust the detection line so we can adjust the detection line through here so you can adjust accordingly so later the the license plate will trigger from this trigger line and once this is done then we click save so once this are done then we can go to the entrance exit and we can do the control mode either by camera or by platform and then we go to the NVR web page in the NVR web page we'll need to add the AMPR into it so we go to the device access and then we need to search for the online device so for the AMPR I'm using is 205 so the IP address will be this 50.17 so 50.17 it's online, so I click on it and add to the device list. Once done, we will be showing connecting. Okay, so so I will need to re-type the password again. I click OK, and I refresh again. We we'll show online. Okay, once this is done, we we'll need to go to the event center and we we'll go to event configuration, event configuration, and then target event, and then we select our this AMPR ca camera channel and here we show a vehicle detection so we click on it vehicle detection and then we allow enable this vehicle detection so once we enable later we can do the vehicle detection on it so we save it and the admin schedule make sure it is uh, fully fully scheduled yeah once this is done then we go to then we need to we can test our AMPR you can do our AMPR testing by scanning the license plate in front of the camera all right once uh, once the car plate is being scanned in front of the camera we can go to the event center event search and then from the search type here we can select target event and then we select the vehicle detection all right and then we can select our camera channel search it so as, is, as you can see over here got a few different type of license plate being scanned so you can look at the picture you can see the license plate number vehicle brand with color and the vehicle type as well and then we also can actually check on the video footage this is a short video clip footage of the ampr uh, license plate being scanned and then if let's say we want to search by the license plates we can also do it, do so by clicking same thing 
target event vehicle detection and then we can search through search by the by typing the car plate for example qck and then we select the camera channel and we search it so it will show all the qck car plates available over here after we have done all the configuration we can also go to the local nvr live view page on the left side there's an event list and we can click on the vehicle icon and whenever the vehicle being detected with the license plate recognition it will show in a pop-up message form on the left side and when we click on either one of the pop-up message it will show live view and also playback thank you for watching hope you enjoyed this video and learn something from it visco